Hi guys! So basically I hadn't come up with any idea for this video so I just thought about talking a little bit of myself I guess um, you know I thought especially about my childhood my teenagehood like I, I think that if you know the childhood about someone you do understand a lot about their personality like you know if you understand uh, the place when someone has grown up uh, you know uh, if you understand how their parents were something like this you do understand a lot more about the person since you know it's in the childhood that we you know develop our brain so i just thought about talking a little bit about my childhood teenagehood especially since i had kind of a rough childhood um you know i didn't realize it back in the days but you know now that i'm you know older i do realize i kind of had a very you know rough childhood and you know, it kind of was, especially for my parents, they were, how can you say that, um, they were very strict, but, you know, we had constantly problems with money, kind of, like, you know, they had enough money to do everything, but they just were not going to give me any at all, like, for them, the only thing I had to do was existing, like, they didn't care if I had to go somewhere, if I had basically to eat, okay, they were just so, so strict on giving me money, and it was, you know, I do think it's what really destroyed our relationship, every day was shouting at them, they shouting me back, sh shouting at me back, it was a constant, you know, fighting them, and I think that's what really uh, destroyed our relationship, you know, I, I, like, now it's different, obviously, like, um, I've been, uh, um, how can I say, now that I work, uh, uh, I remember that when, you know, the first salary that I got, the first, the very first salary that I got, I spent it all, I gave all my money to buy one thing, it was a Gucci bag, and you know, I never been so much happier, like, it ain't much, but it's honest work, like, that Gucci bag was mine, and I bought it by myself with all my money. It was so beautiful, like, I was finally one of them, I was one of those cool kids in the school that has that candle sweater, that Dolce Gabbana, Gucci, and I was one of them, like, they never bought me anything like that, like, I was the only one, that, I went to private school and I was the only one that basically had no Gucci bag, and I remember all of the guys had Gucci bags, and why would you do this to your kid, like, just buy your kid a Gucci bag. Shut up and buy a Gucci bag. Like, why would you do this? But you know, I'm I'm proud of myself. Like now I have, I have it, and I paid it all with my money. And you know, I think it's something that I should be proud of. I remember. Oh, I remember. Like it was not the only thing. I remember. I was like, um, I had, I needed, um, the surgery for my nose, and they were not going to give me the the money to pay the surgery, okay? They didn't want me to get the operation. Why would you do this? If your kid need a nose operation, a surgery to his nose, give him the money to have the surgery. Like, if he need that, give them. Like, why would you do this to your kid? Why would you not give your kid the money to something like that? Like. It's not, it's not that it's just something that I want because I want to be cool, like, I need that to live, I need that, not for biological reason, like, you know, my nose, you know, the functionality of my nose was perfect, but it was too much big for me and I didn't like it, I wanted, you know, a little bit smaller, a little bit elegant, but, you know, I needed it to live, like, if I was ugly, how could I live? So, you know, why, why would you do that? But you give your kid money, like... I don't get it, I don't get it, what people, what, some parents have to be like that, I just don't, get, oh, I remember, I remember, when it was, like, Christmas, some years ago, not a long time ago, okay, I just asked for, um, um, for, uh, the new iPhone, like, all the kids, okay, and they gave me Android, they gave me an Android, I'm not joking, they gave me an Android, why would you do this to your kids? They're your kids. They're literally made out of your blood. And did you really give your kids an android? 
I remember it was probably one of the worst Christmas I have ever passed. I cried so much at Christmas and I don't think nothing will make me forgive them for that. There's so much resentment between us now. I just, I don't think I can forgive them. Sorry, I need a little, I need a little break. Okay. Like, why wouldn't you give your kids what they asked for? What, just, there are no reasons for that. Just give your kids what they want. I don't get it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. I, I'm sorry. For example, when I got my um, driver license, um, I, I basically told them, buy me a car. Like, now I have my driving license, give me a car. And they told me no. They told me that I could use their car and I would have had to pay the gas. And I was like, what? <laughs> what? Are you joking, right? Well, they were not. Do you really think that I'm going to drive your freaking Volkswagen? What? No way! No way! I'm not. I'm not driving a Volkswagen. Like I can. I can understand if you have something like a Tesla or something like this, but I'm not going to drive a Volkswagen. They told me that I should have used the bus to get at work. Like what? <laughs> what? Oh, they were serious. Like they really. Do you really think that I would? ever in my life use public transport like why it was it was yeah i laugh now but it was so painful back in the days it was it was painful why, why would you do this to your kid buy your kid a tesla so you know what actually gave me the strength uh to do this video is because i know that there are out there a lot, a lot of other people that are living a situation uh, very close to mine. So, you know, what I want to tell to those people is that you should not give up. You should keep on going because um, it's hard. But one day you will have that Gucci bag. You will waste all your money but you will have your Gucci bag because I I generally think that you understand the value of things of your own life only when you have a Gucci bag in your hands and you you, you might be laugh you might laugh at this but I do really think this, like, if you, when you actually have a Gucci bag in your hands, like, your life have a, has a whole new meaning. So, you know, keep on going, one day you will have that Gucci bag, okay? And your life will be complete, the void that you feel inside will be fulfilled. Because you will have that Gucci bag, that freaking Gucci bag will be yours, okay? So that's all I want to say. Hold on, boy.